Hi guys, it's Frankie from Frankie Tech. Good to see you guys again, and here with a late night reaction to the now confirmed specs of the OnePlus 8T's display. And a little thought I had that I don't think anyone else has thought about, but first wanna share these specs with you guys because they are very interesting. So we have a 6.55 inch AMOLED display, 120 hertz refresh rate, so just like the OnePlus 8 Pro, like I said in the earlier video, 91.9% screen to body ratio, which is pretty incredible, with a 2.5D flexible, um, yeah, flexible 3D glass almost on the sides. It's not 3D glass, but it's basically kind of that curved edge we see on some phones. JNCD 0.3, that's pretty impressive I would say, and a DCI P3 color space of 100% with a max brightness of 1,100 nits. And as I was looking at these specs, I was thinking, gosh, you know, this doesn't sound like the display on the OnePlus 8 Pro, even though it's now taking a lot of the features that made that display so great, like the 120 hertz, and apparently it's gotten an A plus display rating from DisplayMate, which is pretty incredible. But I was thinking to myself, there's something about these specs I've seen recently. Where could it be from? Where have I seen this before? And I have it right here, the answer. It's the real me X7 Pro, exactly. And so just made me realize that OnePlus and the whole BBK family of phones, they share a lot of parts and a lot of, you know, certain kind of components of their phones, just like the display. And in the case of this real me X7 Pro, 6.5, five inch AMOLED display, 120 Hertz, right? I mean, you're seeing here the whole kind of part of this phone being related to that phone and just how all the BBK family of phones use similar parts. And guys, I have this display in front of me. If the OnePlus 8T's display is anything as good as this Realme X7 Pro's, we're in for a treat because I tell you 120 hertz AMOLED is my new gold standard, I would say, to have on a great phone, just in general. But if you're a flagship phone, you really wanna have this display spec. And in the case of this Realme X7 Pro, it is pretty much the exact, almost very close to the exact same specs as what we're gonna see on this OnePlus 8T. But anyways, I don't think anyone else has actually kind of thought about that or noticed that, that this Realme X7 Pro and the OnePlus 8T are gonna be very similar in many ways. Obviously, with a Snapdragon 865 Plus versus Dimensity 1000 Plus, it's a different story. But in terms of display, at least, I think we have it right here, your first possible look of what will be the display on the OnePlus 8T. But anyways, hit me up in the comments. Do you think that the OnePlus 8T is using the same panel as on this Realme X7 Pro? And do you like these display specs? Do they work for you? Hit me up in the comments. I'd love to hear about it. And that's it for this video. If you liked it, give me that thumbs up. And if you love the content of Rangi Tech, subscribe to the channel. Hit the bell icon for future updates. Just a quick one take react here. No edits, no nothing. I'm gonna go back to watching TV. But anyways, guys, hope you're doing well, staying safe. And this is Frankie Tech, signing off. Have a good one.